So Damien, what kind of future would you like to see for Ireland? Oh, um, what would I like to see? I just, I think what's happened in the past 10 years is we are stuck in a form of gravity. It doesn't matter which government is running the country, it's still the same old, same old. So we're massively in debt, but all the ways of trying to fix it are the same ways that have been used the whole time. We're in a rush, we're in a routine, we are not moving out of that. So I think we need to disrupt everything. I do think a big, big part of that is government, and government hasn't changed. Everything else is changing, people are leaving in droves, all that the usual negative stuff. People are experiencing bad debt, really, really bad debt, but the government hasn't changed. It's the same way of doing things. So I think new ideas need to happen. More people need to address the government directly, tell them what they want, insist on what they want, and not let it go back to what is the default again and again and again. So my big issue, I guess, is default. Stop being, stop being in the same cycle. Change things around. Move people around. Move things around. Bring in new thinking. Try things and fail if needs be, but at least try things. So that's what I think. What do you, what kind of country is possible, say, in 20 years from now? Um, hopefully not a, a country that was the exact same 10 or 15 years ago. Um, people aren't the, the main focus in this country. People's rights and issues, everything like that. We don't put people first. We put the amount that's in our bank account first. Um, I don't know, being all socialist or anything like that, but we just need to put people first, see what the needs are of people and build around that. Um, the same way, like for a business, we, you'd have your strategy and your objectives, and then you go off and you, you run your strategy and you, you, you run your tactics. We don't have that in this country. It's all about tactics, it's all about being reactive. Future planning um, is, is quite important, and we don't plan for the future. We put things off for another government to look after, like bad debt but actually for, for what the people want, that's never thought it. Um, you run a business helping companies figure out their technology and their communications. I'm just thinking, do you have any ideas in terms of job creation and particularly for startups and things like that? Um, a thing the government can do, and if we're just say, talking with the government, is just being more open and more transparent. And we've got this idea of data and using data to help companies. Data is becoming one of the, the biggest resources. Facebook is a data company. All the information they have on people and the way they interact gets sold, you can run advertising against it. The government talks about open data and open data initiatives by opening up their systems so people can extract value and sell on that. Um, even the Department of Communications and Natural Resources, data is a natural resource, but nothing has been done about that. If you open that up, forget about grants for companies anything like that just open that up allow people to play that will create new companies new products new services new ideas um, and just stop with the red tape as well like it's not as bad as other countries but setting up a business doing things with your business getting support for your business like great example is, is food companies small nice like local artisan food companies don't get help from the, the bigger state bodies because they're too small Local enterprise boards have no experience in the food industry because they're experiencing broad businesses. So just, I guess, letting companies do what they want to do without restricting them is going to help immensely. Great. Thanks, Damien.